Thursday, Sacred Heart Shift. All right, good drivers around here. Uh, Thursday, Sacred Heart Shift. I forgot my darn name tag. Darn it. You know, I got up early, showered, brushed my teeth, all that business. I gotta remember to bring my name tag, because I love it. You guys probably remember when I got it. I was so excited. So I'm just gonna wear the stick-on name tag today. All right, later. Picked up my new books. I got the new um, the Star Wars, which I told you about. I'll refresh you. This is uh, an eight-issue miniseries based upon George Lucas's original uh, treatment or script for the Star Wars. And uh, Han Solo is a green alien, and uh, very, very different. Um, last issue was kind of whack. But we'll see where it goes. And then I just saw this kind of randomly. It's Long Shot Saves the Marvel Universe. Um, Long Shot, one of my favorite characters. Uh, also one of the most hated characters in the Marvel Universe. I guess because of his mullet. Um, but the original miniseries, if you're into comic books and haven't read it, it is amazing. And it's got some great, great artwork. And finally, the long-awaited Return of the Sandman by Neil Gaiman. That's right. When uh, DC relaunched or rebooted their entire line, calling it the New 52, they totally lost me. I'm not interested. But the Sandman, I am interested. So, that's my trip to Heroes today. And while I'm here, I'll go ahead and show you guys the uh, Captain America sculpture up here. Can you guys see that? So, good comic book day. I got something to read tonight. Now it's off to uh, eat lunch at home and then back off to school. I'll see you guys later. Alright, here at D&J Hobby getting the brass for the armature. It works as you guys saw. So, uh, as you know, anywhere I live, I have to have a local hobby shop, and D&J is mine. I'll show you this cool, uh, some cool models here. There's a robot. It's pretty cool. There's a cool helicopter. There's some, uh, biplanes. Um, biplanes. There's, uh, model rockets. Um, model cars, D&D &D stuff, uh, tabletop gaming, just look, tons of stuff. And this is a pretty big store, but their old one was actually pretty much bigger, but um, they still have cool stuff. So I got my brass, now I have to go to CVS to get Alicia a leg brace, and then it's off to the foundry for some armature construction. So that is where I will see you next. Down at the foundry here, I ate my dinner, had a salad, and some more of those damn leftover veggies with couscous. So now I'm down here at the foundry and I'm gonna, my goal is to make one joint, which I will accomplish, but I'm gonna do it on a time schedule. So I need to keep track of how long this takes me. Um, so that I'll know how long it's going to take me to finish all of the other ones. Um, David's working on another Stormtrooper. I'm going to show the folks your Stormtrooper here. Look at that. Battle damaged. Is this one for sale or already this sold? This one's um, the Fiant. Ah, not for sale, folks. But he's got many more. So I'm going to work on this joint and I'll let you know how long it takes when I'm done. Peace. Go. Uh, 34 minutes from beginning to end, and that counts setting up the jig too. Me and the drill press that you see right behind me, and uh, the little type and screwdriver and all that. So one takes 34 minutes. So I'm gonna set up an assembly line thing and see if I can reduce that time to about 20 minutes a piece. So see you tomorrow at the foundry.